Hello everyone and welcome back to round 6 of season 2 of Gary and I's F124 co-op career mode. We're back this weekend in the duel in the Formula 1 crown. It's time for the Monaco Grand Prix. If you missed out on the last video from Imola, it was quite an interesting one. Changeable conditions uh, and that didn't play into Gary's hand particularly well. Uh, we, we were both bottle jobs. Uh, we, we didn't really do well in either of the last two Grand Prix uh, for either of us, but... I did beat Gary in both of them, so the championship gap is back down to 15 points. It's wide open, though, in the grand scheme of things, Gary. You can make an argument that anybody inside your top seven is a championship threat, from Leclerc all the way down to Sainz? Lando Norris is not a championship threat. I can tell you that much of the top He's seven. He's ahead of you. Uh, yeah, this, if, if, this, if this game's realistic, Lando Norris is not a threat. Uh, we continue okay. into Monaco today, uh, where Matt has quite the stellar record, actually. So you must be feeling pretty confident coming into this one. Well, I did Monaco last week on a separate stream, and I, I managed to survive, which I was happy with. Um, but yeah, I mean, Monaco is just all about staying out of the walls, isn't it? Staying out of trouble. Uh, and normally for us, if we can do that, we can get a good result. Woo! Nervous. I am nervous. I mean, can you really run a wet setup at Monaco? You're already running maximum downforce. You can't really do a lot else. All right. Let's see what we can do on the full wet tire. I feel like I'm going to fumble here somehow. Not somehow. Probably. Gonna happen. Mitten the barrier. Not big time, but I did get into it. my first time around here on a wet uh, Monaco in F124. Well, spoilers, chat. I had a wet Qatar Grand Prix today, which was quite interesting. Interesting. That, that was not one I was expecting to have. But it was quite... Well, it was, it was quite good fun. I won't reveal too I'm many spoilers. I'm going to be so far off here. Oh, I'm sliding oh, right I through the chicane. Slightly missed me, Apex. Oh, I missed it massively. Oh, I did not want first gear there. Come on. One more corner to go. It's been okay. Oh, it's not been the best bad. lap in the world, but... Pole position. Uh, oh! Complain about that. You're on uh, pole, I'm P2. I'm on pole. Oh, man, I haven't seen you cut that chicane. <laughs> uh, it was not pretty. It was not pretty. I tried to mm. slow it down enough to not abuse it. Oh, I'm so gutted. So gutted. <laughs> I tried the alternate, Gary. I tried the Inters. <laughs> it's intermediate, my god. Yeah. Yeah. It's not much I mean, difference on this game, out. that's the thing. Yeah. If I, if I didn't have that mishap in the chicane, I would definitely still be front row, but I would have expected you uh, to pull. I, 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 I think we probably did as badly as each other, sir, but. Oh, okay. Front row lockout by Gary and I. We'll, we'll, bo we'll both have to make sure we leave the chicanes in the edit. Oh, yeah. Um, But. That, that does us some good in terms of the championship, Gary. Especially if the top two in the title are right behind us. Right, we've got to focus. we got to do this. I'm hoping Gary for no issues. I... Like, I want to make sure this force feedback, make sure the wheel's working. That would be very nice. I would take a, no, a Gary no force feedback. So immediate lead. Gary got a good start. He's immediately and, cut on one chat. And I got force feedback. Ah, The go. one hope I had at the start of this. Oh. You alright there, Gary? Yeah, why? Just immediately a little bit away from the apex oh, oh, through the top of the hill. normal line in the wet here. Is it? Yep. Oh, well, hello. That's, not, that's definitely <laughs> not it. This bodes well. So difficult early on. I'm, I'm maybe, maybe we'll pull away from the AI, but I'm not optimistic. Not feeling good right <laughs> off the bat. I was sure. gonna say, how many times have you understood, sir? That Mercedes is looking like a handful. It's only lap one. Struggling with temperature or something? Uh, talent, talent for sure. Fair enough. I believe that. I 
I'm out of the race. I'm out of the race. Couldn't stop. What do we make of that, chat? Couldn't stop the car. I was saying, well, you, it wasn't that you couldn't stop it, you were just far too optimistic. Uh, <laughs> I broke before you from zone. behind. That is my very <laughs> normal break zone. I broke before you and I was behind <laughs> you. I knew that was, uh, I, as soon as the uh, right, front wheel slid, I was like, uh-oh. Well, immediately. we're going to be here for about half an hour at least. I, I'm kind of feeling, chat, I could give him the restart, but on the other hand, I got screwed in Jeddah when I was going to win that race. Oh. Or at least we were going to have a good fight for it. So I'm not really convinced I want to give him the restart. Plus, the idea of your highlights being a minute and a half long is quite funny to me. Gary, I mean, to be fair now, as long as I get a podium, we're going to be ahead of Gary in the championship. But, hey, thank you, Cameron. I appreciate it. Push the safety car. I cannot risk anything here, chat. This is going to be like... Hey! Chat! Safety car's gone! But it's it's appeared like halfway through the track. Hey! Let's all There's like remember. four of... Gary, the safety car disappeared and four of us have overtaken it. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> it's a red flag! What on earth okay, is that? Right, come on. So let's try and survive again. do him any favors now. When have you done me any favors anyway? Oh god, so many times. <laughs> no, this season, I mean, this season. Uh, the safety car in Bahrain that I caused for you, actually. Hang on a minute, weren't you behind me? I mean, it helped uh, me out. Uh, it but... won you the race, and it was your idea, and I said, okay. <laughs> you know, I said that for you, not me, sir. No. Okay, fair enough, right. Any more? Oh, Australia, you screwed me. Uh, Telling me the soft when you uh, barreled me into the barrier. Oh yeah, no, but I apologise for that one. Oh, okay. that was just a miscommunication. Oh, okay. Right, chat. I think we just got to try and pull away from the AI now. Give ourselves a little bit of safety. Ready for if we get the switch to drives. I mean, this is basically a bit Gary. I mean, what this is is my version of Jeddah. I think I'm entitled for that, Jeddah. surely. Yeah. I disagree. Why? Uh, I disagree. Plus, I want to become the second multi-time winner of the year. I think I should have been year. granted my restart there. Really? You never asked for I one. Do. You know that, right? You, you turned it down immediately. No, I, I, but you never so asked. I wasn't going to argue. You never asked, sir. If you'd asked, maybe I would have considered you, it. From Matt's stream, what happened? Uh, Matt just barreled us off into turn one. Well, hang on a minute, hang on a minute. F1 24 seems to be getting worse for optimization, Gary. Oh, did you have that too? No, no, not right then, but it, I just noticed. Oh, okay. I had one, it, it, genuinely, first time ever, I think, on this game. It just completely crashed on me a couple of weeks ago. Oh, nice. A couple of days ago, even. Luckily, I was only on, like, lap two or something, but yeah. Hang on, I did... <laughs> The, the difference here, Gary, is you just bottled it. <laughs> yeah, but I'm gonna make sure I wreck you this time. Why? So why why do I just to, like, watch me for the rest of the race? Right. Okay. It seems very odd. And it it kind of just seems to me, Gary, that you're mad with yourself, not me. Oh, come on, Red Bull. Bloody useless. Oh, there, there is not much grip here, chat. This might have been too early. This might have been a mistake. Just, just going to put that out there. Maybe we can get some temperature in, but... Oh, it's so understeery. Oh, you get anywhere off the dry line and it's cooked. Gary, I might have bottled this. What are you doing? Uh, it's... You can't tell where the wet line is, so it's quite difficult. Like, it's fine if you stay on the dry line, but get a wheel off and it's immediate death. But the longer the AI stay out, chat, the more water gets shifted off the line, so. You, you think the game's that realistic? It's not bad this year, to be fair, with that. Okay, it's bad in a lot of other ways, ahead, but... but. Remember, we need to get to the end of the race on these tyres. Ugh! 
Like, the, the wet, dry line is pretty good, I'd say. Yeah, but I have no belief that the EA slash Codemasters was good enough to make that AI-induced more of a, a game just designed to do it no matter what. Oh, yeah. Why does the Ferrari sound so horrendous on the onboard? Oh, it's awful. This I don't know why they've changed it. It's so bad. It's one of the big reasons. Spoiler chat, I'm going to leave Ferrari at the end of the season in driver career. Oh, it's that Portier is lethal. It's like being on an ice rink. Actually, this should be all right. I don't know. I have no idea. Ah, oh, they're doing fine. Or you can just take out Gary. I don't need to take out Gary. He does that to himself. None of the AI pit? Hey, Why are they staying out? Don't say they're going to try and go to the end. Great work. I've seen them do this before. The race. And gap to the car in front, 3.0 seconds. The AI, for some reason, chat, occasionally are quite smart now. And will just stay out on the wrong tyre. If they don't think they'll lose enough time. I mean, we are now going comfortably quicker, though, so... It's probably not in their best interest, but if they can't overtake each other, then why wouldn't they? Can't you just mod in Ayrton Senna? Because he kind of looks like Kimmy. Ayrton Senna. Yeah, but you can't change the dead name. Can you? No, not in F123. Can you? No, only F12020 was the last game you could actually mod the names of drivers. Oh, I thought you could in 2021 as well, but... Maybe 2021, but I was I was I Ow! Did research and I was like, "Ooh, can we mod names? Because that would change everything." But no, you can't. So, Ricardo's useless, I man. Okay, He's just giving me a load of damage. damage Lol. Well. Why would you fight that so hard? This this is where a crash happens, Gary. Yeah, signs to Red Bull. Oh, they're pitting. They're pitting. They're pitting. Finally. I'm still worried this is going to be closer than I'd Science like. Science Red Bull is a solid option, because I did have Perez leaving plan no matter what, so. Oh, that's oh I can't really oh. go for it. Yeah, say, especially if the AI are going to pit, which Albon does. Leclerc's exiting now. He's heading onto the track as we speak. Oh, no. Charles, surely. He's actually going to jump me. But he's yeah, got to try and get temperature in his size. These guys, and he's on a tire that's white. Why is he on hards? <laughs> you should be able to easily get him, actually. So Let's hope so. Yeah, I like that idea. Signs to Red Bull, I think is... Yeah, that's a match you want to move if I've ever seen one. Um, it was clean? Uh, clean, but silly. Why oh, was it silly? I've like made a, it work. It was like, that was like an air of a career mode video move where I click off the video, basically. <laughs> And to be fair, he was caught up behind the Inter runners. I was talking about it earlier. I was like, uh, I cannot stand how he races in his career mode. Oh, yeah. And like, I'm like, that Wait, alone, I, I can't watch. It's it rewinds turned on, isn't it? It's what it is. That's the problem. Oh, well, yeah. Like, you know, every That's move is obvious. taken in five attempts. <laughs> I would love to look for a raw hour of recording of Monaco, like the raw file. Did you see the one where he accidentally left one of his flashbacks in the video? No. That was probably a couple months back. But he post commentates he, it. How would he have left that in? Yeah, that's what I was like. How do you screw that up? But he left it and then edited it out, edited it out after the video went out. Oh. Oh. How odd. Right, well, chat, we're back into the lead then. That was all the scary, hopefully all the scary stuff's done. Let's just try and king of entertainment, but still. The but the problem is, like, and I know obviously a lot of people, well, a lot of people do find it entertaining, but it's a bit like why I don't find NASCAR that good a lot of the time. You're kind of there going, but it's, it's forced, isn't it? Yeah. Or, like, why I've never understood how people can watch WWE. You're kind of going, it's all I, I scripted. I pride in, like, my videos and, and series being natural and then just letting it play out and not forcing but, anything. But you've got a storyline in mind, but kind of yeah. what happens on the track, isn't it? One more lap to go, then, okay, here from lap. these most final famous the streets. Gary, talk to me. I'm talking to you. 
From your perspective, how has this Grand Prix been? Uh, I really haven't paid attention. We've been kind of so engaged in uh, career mode talk. So I really just looked up and you were back out in front. So here we are watching Matt 212 come around a couple of right-handers heading into the tunnel. Gets dark in here. Heads back out into the sunlight covered by clouds. Say so it's not much into sunlight the pool today. Section, takes the left, takes the right, cuts it just to make sure he's safe from Leclerc. It's going to turn left here, passing the yachts that none of us can afford. Through the chicane, passing all the grandstands cheering for Brad Pitt when he does his celebration after Matt's done his own. Rounds the final couple of corners. The mickiest win of all time out of the final turn. Oh, B. Oof. <laughs> He's trying to throw it away right at the end, but he picks up the victory. He wrecks us to make sure he didn't have to face us. Oh, B. You have to respect it. You have to respect it. You got to get What's it. that now? What's that now? Three Monaco Grand Prix wins carry well, to your zero. Monaco is not, not as big of a win as you think it is. is well, it's 25 points on the board, sir, and it's me back ahead of you at the championship. That's how big it is today. It's no Coca-Cola 600, I can tell you that. You get more points when? for winning a Coke 600 than any other race. When when have we done the Coke 600 together? Remind me. Oh, we ain't going to do it together because it would be pretty bad. Oh, it'd be great. We, I, I tell you what. If seven times in 100, in 100 laps. Seriously, if NASCAR 25 has a court mode, I'd genuinely love to do a oh, season. Oh, we're definitely doing it. <laughs> It'd be so fun. <laughs> Monaco, baby. That is the dub yet again. We'll take those. We take those, chat. I was concentrating so much, I kind of haven't really focused on that in the end. But P1, 25 points on the board. I mean, we were just... We, we, we took the oh, lead at the Gara's mistake. We, we just were able to hang on. We, it was a little bit touch and go when, when we when we botched the strategy. Uh, but ultimately, the win is the win there. What does that do to the championship? Well, it means Leclerc now has a 21-point buffer over Verstappen there. Alonso in P3 ahead of myself. Gary all the way down there in P6 in the championship. And remember how Lando Norris wasn't a title threat? Lando Norris still ahead of him in the championship. Red Bull, we He's retake the constructors' lead. Points. Red Bull take the constructors' lead back off of Ferrari. Mercedes down to fifth. How bad are they at this stage of the campaign? Dart with another five community subs. Thank you to all the YouTube viewers for watching. And we'll be back next time, ready in Montreal.